Economic Forum is was really organized so that uh, businesses from all over the world uh, can come together, you know, along with government as well as uh, people from the academe. And I think in this particular, uh, for this year, there's about 2,700 participants, uh, 1,600 of which are from the business sector. I think this, has been, this is the first time in almost 10 years, I believe, that uh, we've actually participated. As you know, seven of the, of the largest corporations uh, are actually part of this uh, 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 contingent. So I think that this is a very strong signal. Uh, that the Philippines is uh, open for business and that uh, we are, uh, you know, it, it, I think this is a good chance for us to showcase uh, uh, what the growth story of the Philippines as a country. I believe President Marcos has been very effective in, um, you know, showcasing the Philippines our strength but also showcasing that this government is open for business and open to partnerships, you know, with other governments but as well as with partnerships with, uh, with, uh, with private sector. Um, and that we are here trying to bring in really foreign investments. On the political front, I think also my view is that the president has really shown that the Philippines is really a friend to all, no? uh, and that we're not necessarily leaning more towards the West or the East, that we're very, very balanced in where, in where we are positioned. And I think that's the right strategy because you know, our location as a country is so strategic. Um, you know, we are right in the middle of Asia, um, and we are you know, within a four, four hour flight distance to 70% of, of, of Asia. So that is that puts us in a very good, uh, very uh, important position, very strong position you know, for tourism, um, logistics, manufacturing. You know, as uh, for, for Alliance Global, as you know, we're um, into real estate, we're into tourism as well. Um, and more importantly, we have also global operations through our distilled spirits uh, company. Um, you know, we have um, operations in, in the UK, we have operations in Spain, and we have operations as well in Mexico. Um, and so, you know, in, a very, in, a, in a way, we are a Filipino company with a very strong global presence. Um, and I think this forum is uh, very important for a company like ours. Uh, you know, I think there's a lot of meetings on the sidelines. Uh, there's a lot of things we can learn, but also uh, partnerships and cooperation that can be created you know, uh, from this particular platform. Um, I, you know, like I said, on another note, I think the Philippines as well, we're very strong, st strongly invested in tourism. Um, and so, you know, it's a way for us to also promote the Philippines. Uh, well, you know, I think that this, again, we have... Uh, we're very excited to join President Marcos. This, uh, I guess, this this trip and this, I guess, this journey for the Philippines. It's you know, after two years of uh, this pandemic, uh, as he has said, we've kind of taken a step back. But, but I guess in that process, there's so much realization. But what is needed really is global cooperation. I think that our president is a firm believer in globalization. You know, coming to the World Economic Forum, I think that uh, his, you know, his his belief uh, can be made known. To a large audience, um, and that I think is uh, is, is will, set, will give the Philippines a, a lot of credibility in the global community.